Hello, my name is Frances Digby and I am a picture book author and I am really, really thrilled because this month our book, The Seed, has been chosen as the SBB book of the month. I wrote this book this time last year and because I knew that picture books take a long time to get printed, I tried to anticipate where we might be in the future. So I tried to anticipate where we might be now, and I hope we've got it right, because The Seed is all about the quiet kindnesses that swept across the world during the pandemic. Those lovely, lovely seeds that were planted that have blossomed, that will long outlast the pandemic, hopefully. So it's about hope, and it's about beauty, and it's about life always finding a way. It's illustrated by Baolu, and it's published by Studio Press, and I'm going to share it with you now. Thank you for listening. When the world was safe indoors, we each planted a seed. We found new ways of sending all the things that people need. We learnt the names of neighbours and we smiled and said, hello. We shared the skies and lullabies. The seed began to grow. When the world was safe indoors, we started sending letters and every day the world began to get a little better. We filled the streets with rainbows, we filled our hearts with hope, and the colours caught the sunshine like a jewelled kaleidoscope. The streets were always quiet, the cars were always parked, the sky was full of birdsong from the blackbird and the lark, the world seemed somehow softer every morning on our walk. We shared the sun with everyone, the seed became a stalk. We learnt to take our time because we didn't count the hours. And from the good, there came a bud. The bud became a flower. And as we watched it blossom, its spiralled leaves unfolding, we all let out the breath we didn't know that we were holding. And when we looked around us, we realised there were more. The world was full of flowers that we didn't see before. When the world was safe indoors and people were apart, Although the doors were closed, the world had opened up its heart. And when the doors were opened and we stepped into the sun, so many things were different, but the kindness carried on. It floated through the windows, under doors and over gates. It hid inside the presents, shopping bags and dinner plates. It carried through computers and commuters, even letters. When everyone was safe indoors, the world was getting better. It spread across the planet like a high-speed hurricane, and we knew that nothing ever would be quite the same again. We found so much we didn't know that we were looking for, from the seed that slowly grew when the world was safe indoors.